Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon White Nuzlocke. In the last one, we, um... What did we do? We did the gym. That's right, we did the gym. Oh, we beat the third gym. I was trying- it's been a while since I <laughs> recorded for Pokemon White, I'm so sorry. Um, now we're about to battle Bianca, and I'm a little terrified because I don't remember, um... Um, what she has, so I'm looking it up right now, because I know as soon as I go in those gates, she's going to be there. So I just need to know and prepare myself for that. Okay, trainers, please tell me the trainers here. Please, please, please. I don't like this. Okay. Okay. She's a herdier, a Muna. Whatever starter, and then whatever monkey you have coordinated. Okay. We got this. Uh, I believe she opens up with the herdier. So why not pick a fight with the herdier as well? Alright. I'm a little nervous. But we got this, okay? Believe in yourself and anything could be possible. There she is! Chris! You remember the promise you made on the X-Tree and Zebra, right? Okay, let's battle. Let's get right into our Pokemon battle. But for that... Alright. They said we can have a Pokemon battle in the gate as long as we're careful enough to break the electric bulletin board. I'm the new and improved version of me. It's gonna be great this time. Let's start our Pokemon battle again. Okay. Wait, level 18s and her main... Pokemon is level 20. I might be able to level for this fight. If I even do anything. It's just... It's the level cap for the area. I think we have this in the back since we are five uh, levels higher than her shit. Alright, let's see. Um... I feel like Courtney could be fine the entire time that we're here, so let's just spam work up and just do something, you know? Have a normal attack back and we'll start. I don't know why I use that move. That one only works against ghosts and we're not a ghost, so we're normal type. I'm going to use Tackle. That should be fine, right? Wait, please tell me it kills itself here. It'd be super funny. I didn't kill itself right there. That was not funny. I did use a super potion, though. Do we have potions? Which one do we need to heal right now? We have seven potions! I need to pick a lemonade. Alright, we just healed this turn. I'm gonna do one more workup and then we'll we'll tackle it again. Corny's got this, alright. Corny might not be my favorite at all in the Total Drama universe, but she be killing it right here. Whoa, whoa! Why did that do so much? Man, that critical attack really made me nervous. Yes, keep battling. I don't want to waste the two workups that we have. I'm gonna heal and then you fight on this thing. Shh! Don't tell them about the bite! <laughs> Depending on what it uses here, I might use another workup and get plus three. It's gonna really fuck it. Another workup. Or get, no, just bite it. Get rid of this thing. Wait. When the 
the hell did I give Corny a chest of berry? <laughs> okay, that's funny. I don't remember when I gave her that berry, but good thing. Alright, tackle. We have plus three attack on, on Corny right now. We can do anything. Except kill this thing in one head, are you serious? Well, I guess... Why? Oh, it's really fine. It's fine. The demon gets used leech seed on me. That's so funny. <laughs> this run is so pretty. Unfortunately, I'm never gonna use a snipe in fucking Gen Five. Are you kidding me? All that thing knows is normal and grass type moves. Crunch. Okay, let's see. Is that better than bite? Yes. With a, like a chance of decreasing defense, that shit's good. Hand four. Uh, just crunch. That should be fine. I mean, Corny has swept through Bianca. That is so fucking funny. I train with Iris, but I still can't win. Two thousand dollars for Chris. <laughs> Which Chris is me. Oh, she's a little head thing. I love it. I want her to be a strong trainer like you were cheering her iris, but you know, since we left Unova Town, I met a lot of people that I know, and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at it that way, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having my Pokemon stolen was just really hard, and I felt really unsure. So I gotta say, I'm really glad I went. I've learned so much from this journey. I've already learned about being with Pokemon is really, really important. Okay, well, I hope you I see you again soon. Bye-bye, Chris. A trainer from Nuvella Town has challenged and successfully beat Berg. Let's go. Alright, Sharon. Okay, it's on Route 4. Let me wipe this shit. Route... For Unova. He's scary to me. I don't care about the Pokemon here on Unova, they're the gym trainers. Okay, since we chose Tepic, he starts with Padov, leads into Leopard, Pansier, and then Duat. Okay. Do we want to do the same strategy or we just keep Courtney out the entire time? No, that's not a bad strategy. I'm for it. I can see if I can swipe by him real quick so I can heal fully. Also, we gotta give Cornea something else to hold since um, since she used her berry that I, that I totally knew she had. Uh, sure. Does any of these have like shitty moves? Makes it well. Pampor has gone. Can't see her, sorry. So, there you go. Alright, let's let us go. Okay, sneak. Bugitch! Alright, I'm a little nervous. Charon is a tough trainer. He's got level 20 Pokemon, and his ace is level 22. So I think I'm gonna do the same strategy, where I use work of a bunch, heal, and then sweep. I feel like that strategy worked last time, so I'm gonna do it again. Hey, Jaren. Hey, Chris. I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge, and now it's time to see which of us is the stronger trainer. And he's finally got a fire type on his team. It took long enough. Look! <sighs> Padog! With super luck is the ability, and then the moves Leer, Quick Attack, Air Cutter, and Roost. Alright, let's see what we got. We won't get hurt by the sandstorm since Courtney's got like a big fur coat. An 
actually seeing silent moves. I cannot believe this. You seem to understand the importance of the first attack very well. Oh, I'm just spamming work up until I need to attack. Ah, shit, our defense is down. I don't want to take it out now. Alright, let's go for it. Stab, attack, plus two, attack. Let's go. You gotta be careful now since Courtney is minus one defense. Do you want already? Are you feeling threatened? What does Duot have? Water Sport, Focus Energy, Razor Shell, and Fury Cutter. Um, okay. Um, try to lower his defense real quick with Crunch. Oh! We critical hit it? Why was I so worried about this fight? Why is this fight going so much better than I thought it would? Pantsier. Sure, keep battling. I'm not wasting the two attacks that we have. Alright, Pantsier. Gluttony, Incinerate, Fury Swipes, Yawn, and Bite. No held move. Okay. Fuck it, let's use Crunch, see what happens. Man, we are killing it! Courtney's the goat. We're keeping Courtney. And then Leopard, alright. Alright, as Unburden, it has Sand Attack, Fury Swipes, Pursuit, and Torment. Which we will use a tackle for. Well, actually, we can use Rock Smash since it's a dark type. I cannot. The critical hit, too! Why was I so worried about this fight? Why was this the easiest fight in the world? Impressive, but why can't I win? Dude, I swept, dude. I don't. That I never swept Charon before like that. It's now clear to me. The reason you are so tough is trusting you and your Pokemon. But that shouldn't be a problem. I can get more out of Duod and my other Pokemon too. Hold on. Hold on, my agent's calling. Hold on. Oh, that's Professor Jennifer. Okay. Chris, do you have a second? Professor Jennifer, did you hear something? Call me Anka too, but I guess you didn't hear the call. I wonder what she'll she caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just call her again later. Well, I'll be waiting for you two in front of the gates in the Boston City. Um, hello? We can't hear her that well. The, the, the sandstorm's going too strong. That's the gate is straight down Route 4. Alrighty. I'm gonna sugar, 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 sugar. I cannot believe we fucking swept that. I cannot believe that shit. That is so funny. God, why was that so easy? Sharon needs that burn heal. Well, at a time like this, let's have a Pokemon battle. I believe our level cap is 20. What's the fucking level? 27, right? So I can't over level Courtney. Because I believe she's level 24 right now? Well, well we're gonna find that in a second. She's coming out first. So once she reaches level 25, we'll switch someone else in the front. Trent would be fine here, since it is a desert area. Uh, this is Chocolate. You don't need to set up for a fucking Daramaka. Tackle again should be fine. I can't wait to give Courtney all the fang moves <laughs> in the world. I believe we can get in the Ice City? Not the Ice City. The one with the flying gym. I believe that's where you can trade the height scales. But I need to research that actually. <laughs> Embargo. No, you're not learning that move. That move sucks ass. I see. Was that your favorite Pokemon? It's starting to be, and I don't like I put a shitty name to it. I kid, Corny's an okay character. I just don't like her. <laughs> Trent's in the front. We actually have an even amount of, like, each gender. Holy shit. Alright. We can go straight here. 
actually it's really hard for, I don't know if it's just me probably just me it's really hard to tell which sand paths are the ones that activate Pokemon and which ones are like safe to walk on I think it's just the the light like the brightness on my the computer Can I, I don't know if that affected the thing but I made it a bit brighter um, Supersonic. Confuse it. Why are you wearing pants? I need Trent to pour the fuck up so he can actually do something useful for the team. Uh, use Bubble Bean. It's still confused. Okay, please hit yourself. Holy shit, it actually hit itself. Okay, we should kill it with Bubble Beam here. If not, I think Trent dies. <laughs> and that would suck. Okay, good. Alright, Trent is done. It's just, we're not using Trent anymore. Sorry, buddy. Um, oh, Hondra should be fine here. Okay, I have to like lean my head down to see the paths. This is the way. If I have it up, then I, it's like they combined. The travel partner is a my travel par partner is a Pokemon that is a popular guidebook recommended. That ape. Oh my god! I need a compilation of me of not reading this shit right. <laughs> Backpacker Anna, you made me mess over my words. Connie is the best guide partner? Okay, if you say so. Look at Alejandro. Alejandro's grace. Alright, um, assist, because we're gonna need some assist since we're here. The claw is the best. Con, what's the point of me going first if you're gonna use con spore on me? That's not fair. Go find me two bitches. Sorry, attack was fine. Okay, pretty good move. Um, I think cut with two more though. Okay. I thought that would do a lot. I was a little scared there. Stop using cotton spore on me! It's bad enough that you have to use it first. Even though I had the fucking quick claw. Get out of here. Guidebook does not tell me how to win. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can see that. Okay, okay. I'm on the path. I'm not, okay. Backpacker. <laughs> Where did you come from? Me? Well, if you win, I'll tell you. Who is the lady that says that she's from- Like, she just left Castilia City? Uh, back and back paper gel. She got Panago? My favorite! Man, I wish I got to do an encounter in the Pinwheel Forest. I would have loved to have this thing on my team. But don't worry, if we do do Pokemon- Pokemon, uh, White 2. Um, there's a chance of us getting that in, um, in Castilia City, so, fair game. Uh, let's use assist. Maybe we get a fucking flamethrower. Or flame charge, ember, leer at it. Alejandro's gonna stare you down. Make your defense drop. Stop fucking using Mega Drain on me, it's so- oh. I did just damage. Alright, you're gonna fight now. Quick claw again? Go on, you're moving fast. Stop using Mega Drain! Stop- You're gonna make me, like, not like you. <laughs> Alright, gone. Get out of here. Out of my sight. 
first battle and I lost. <laughs> well, that sounds like a skill issue. <laughs> Alright, let's get all 100 out of here. Let's do... Um, Zoe? Zoe. So I should be fine, right? What's this here? A super potion, okay. Yeah, I need to challenge this guy. The fun of traveling around the world is having serious battles. With a lot of Pokemon I meet. Wait, what the- Waylon? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Should we try Eva in this battle? I feel like that'd be fun. Alright, Eva, your first battle. And it's against a Blood Soul. Please don't use Pursuit. They didn't use Pursuit, that's good. It probably is an electric type move. So we're about to be like, ha, sod, bitch. Shot. See, we, we called the bluff, you know? We're so good at that. Um, Zantoon sounds fun. Eva did it. Eva's got Moxie going on. Is he another Pokemon? Or no? Well, you're a top tier, uh, Top class trainer in the best of the world, and what do I know? <laughs> All right. Are you kidding me? I'm trying to get out of here. Fucking Dormanitan, get out of here! Well, Zoe is trying to get to the desert resort so we can get a new Pokemon. And I'm hoping it's a Sigala. <laughs> I don't want to use Dormantan. We do have a fire type. It's not wrong to get another fire type. It's actually good to have diverse types just in case something happens, but it would just kind of be sitting there for a long ass time. Oh. So, um, I'm trying to think what else is here. Sand Isle is here, but we can't get that because we're playing by the no duplicate roll. So it's a Sigilith, the, the Cactus, Dermaka, and Scraggy, I think. I don't know if there's anything else, but in the castle we can get. We're guaranteed to get Yamask. We are sending a flying type against a rock. That's not good. Um, <laughs> Trent? Trent, can you even do anything? Get fucking corny can deal with it. So, yeah, Yamask is a hundred percent in the in the relic castle, and then we can pick up the the fossil. But I'll do that in the next episode. The desert resort will be its own episode. Darkness. Yay! We lowered its defense too. That's pretty good. Stop putting fucking sand in Courtney's coat, man. She just fucking furious it this morning, right? Timber. Oh, yes, switch out. This probably has a rock type move. Fine, put Zoe in. Zoe, look at me, girl. You have to hit it, or else you're going to die and kill everyone else in your team, alright? You're, you're like five levels higher than her, right? You can do this, alright? I need you to cut it with air cutter. Can you do that? Okay. Thank god. I was so scared for a moment. I'm digging myself into a big hole. Why did he make that face like that? He's like, whoa. Sorry. Oh, yeah. 
this guy too. I bet it was like a construction project. They're both a piece of cake to me. For me. Sorry. <laughs> I, I do that in, in like the fan for me all the time where I just like to read something else. Oh my god, how many timbers are here? I, I guess it makes sense. They're always carrying a piece of wood, so why not put them in the construction field? But like, come on. Just trying to get to the desert resort. Oh god, a pretty pit too. Level 24 for Zoe! I guess I should do pretty good. Oh, it's a piece of cake. It was hard to swallow. Alright. If we talk to this guy in here, you should give us dig. And there's a vending machine! You bet your ass when I finish this recording. You know what? I'll do this right now. It's gonna be four minutes of me sitting here buying lemonades. <laughs> We need it, alright? We're running low on eight, um, uh, health potions, alright? Lemonade is the way to go. And you can't tell me otherwise. Alright, one more. And then we'll go get a dig. Alright. See? It's a good idea. Alright, TM for dig. That will be useful in the Elisa gym. Pretty nice. It's a two turn move. You bury yourself in the ground, missing any attacks, unless it's earthquake that does hit you. Is, it, is the earth shaking? I gotta be careful, I might get an encounter here. These guys just kinda stand here. here. Let's hope I don't. Should I save state? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, okay, I made it. I think we have time to challenge the doctor over here, the, the, the doctor nurse. And we can get an encounter and just go on our way. Who would be perfect for this? I feel like Sully's fine, right? Even though I feel like this thing does have a Muna. And Alejandro would be perfect for it, but Alejandro kind of died right now. So let me, um, real quick heal him real quick before we challenge this doctor. Let's see, where, where did I put all those lemonades? I just bought <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, switch the... Can't heal Alejandro and I'll put him at the front. Okay. I want everyone to at least be 25 when we leave here, so hopefully we can do that. I'm a trainer first and a doctor second. Yeah, I can clearly see that. You know how many times in a Nuzlocke doctors have killed my Pokemon and they're like, Here, let me do that. Let me heal them for you. And I'm like, no, it's too late, Jerry. They're already dead. Alright, I knew they had a psychic type. Alright. I just thought it was Muna. I believe we actually can get this type, because I think uh, the, the Gothena line is, is Pokemon Black exclusive, so we'll get this line. I mean, it's a good line. I believe this one's the better one for the exclusive anyway, so... Almost had it. Now I was using light screen to be fucking difficult. Hyper potion. That, isn't that a little overkill? I just realized we're two levels below this thing. That's not good. Is light screen protected from the um the sandstorm, or does it have an ability for that? I don't know. I'm not gonna look it up. <laughs> All right. It was level 23 now. We gotta give the XP share to Trent. <laughs> Never me to po be a trainer. I can't help but battle. Give me your paycheck. 
All right, kill my Pokemon, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Resort is a harsh place. Do you have medicines? I do. All right, let's see who we get, and we'll end the episode here. I'm hoping a Sigalith. Even though it's pretty rare to get a Sigalith. Okay, fine. We'll take the Darmaka. Fine. <laughs> we can use him during the ice gym. It's fine. Hi, buddy. How are you? Don't want to use a cut and kill it, right? Yeah, it's fine. Oh, okay. Alejandro almost fucking <laughs> died. Who can handle attacks best? Um, Corny, stand there. And take one for the team. <laughs> Why did that do so much damage? You're not very fun, dude. Alright, we need a. Oh, we can use that quick ball and got this thing over with. Oh, look, it was just a normal ball. This thing's scary already. Really want it. Scraggy would have been good. So we got this thing. Thermaka was caught. <laughs> I say that so disappointedly. Yeah, he's been added to the Pokedex. That's great. What a fucking fun addition. Send Charm Pokemon. Thermaka drop. Thermaka's droppings are hot, so people used to put them in clothes to keep themselves warm? Wait, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Were people putting. I'll let you look into that however you see fit, but we gotta name this thing. It's a fire boy. I feel like Duncan would be an appropriate name for this little arson boy. So Duncan it is. Hopefully we get to use Duncan, because Duncan's one of my favorite characters in the the total drama um, in the scene, so his name Duncan. Yeah, yep, uh, okay. Doctor, I need you to heal me again. Alright! We're gonna try to get everyone up to level 25, which means Corny is done, and you don't get this item anymore. And we're gonna give it to Trent, <laughs> before I forget. Trent is struggling mad hard right now, so... Alright! Zoe's almost done, too. We gotta get Owen up. He's far behind for being a starter. And Alejandro and Trent definitely need to get their numbers up as well. But, um... Yeah. So, we challenged Bianca and Sharon. We got through out four. We made it to the Diz Resort and picked up this little Duramaka, which I totally wanted. I'm not judging. I promise. Um, Alright, so, in the next one, we'll go to explore the does resort, find some useful items, challenge some trainers, get buff, and then we'll go in and grab our fossil and another Pokemon, which totally isn't a 100% uh, Yamas since we have a Sandile with us. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!